Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2022-23 Panini Donruss Optic Basketball 12 box hobby case random team number one, a brand new release just dropped today. All teams in, all cards shipped. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. Thanks to the people who bought their spot straight up. Thanks to the people who got into the retail box. Congrats to the winners. And, uh, and congrats to uh, Steve for winning that extra spot in that spot giveaway promo. So a lot going on here. And there are the teams. All 30 are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Six and a six, 12 times for names and teams. One, two, three, four. And 12th and final time, six and a six. We got Rick down to Josh after 12. Six and a six, 12 times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, 10, and 12th and final time. We got Motor City down to Nolens. Nolens? The big easy. All right, Rick with Detroit, Steve with the Hornets, Bob with the Clippers, Richard with the Kings, King Richard, Steve with the Suns, Jacob with the Spurs, Steve H with the Nets, Scott with the Warriors, Matt Arnold with the 76ers, Matthew with the Hawks, Ryan with the Knicks, Gabe with the Grizzlies, Jed with the Rockets, Kevin with the Mavs, Ed with the Magic, Steve with the Lakers, We've got my Lakers, Douglas with the Timberwolves, Scott with the Trailblazers, Ryan, Last Pod Mojo, Pacers, Matthew with the Raptors, Hunter with the Celtics, Scott with the Bulls, David with the Cavs, Steve Nolson with the Bucks, Scott with the uh, Nuggets, Bob with the Jazz, Ching with the Heat, Jim Way with the Wizards, Matthew with the Thunder, and Joshua with the Pelicans. And let's sort alphabetically by team. We're going to pause the video just for a little bit. And when we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades and we'll have the full case break. Stick around. We'll be right back. All right. Welcome back, everybody. There was a deal done. So Scott and Ryan got a deal done. So Ryan is out of the Knicks spot, gets his favorite team, the Bulls. Scott is out of the Bulls spot and gets his team, the Knicks. That worked out nicely. All right, so the rest of the list remains the same. No other deals were done. Let's print and rip. All right, and just in case we get redemptions, checklist is in the chat, ladies and gentlemen. get an idea of who your teams may possibly have. Big thanks to this group once again for making it happen. Brand new release. we got another full case random team loaded up in the store right now. Check it out. Alright. There it is. And here we go. Yeah, there might be eventually some pick your teams of this. But if you have zero luck with the random teams, don't don't join those random team breaks. Steve Olson, save your money, man. All right, here we go. One autograph, a bunch of parallels, all card ship. Got Jabari Smith Jr. on the cover, on-card rated rookie signatures, the Photon. Those are the short prints that we're looking for. Good luck, everyone. <laughs> See, I appreciate you getting in then. He's like, if, if you had a pick your table, we wouldn't have gone to the random team. I would have been like, don't join at all. Kind of 
not liking what the packaging is doing here. It's a little, a little too flimsy. There we go. Let's find the right, the right tempo for it. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're watching live, this break will probably take us pretty close to the, uh, probably close to the end of the evening. Yeah, maybe I always forget. Is it a normal thing? I feel like every year that an optic comes by, I'm just like, ah, oh. you know, the packs are falling apart in my hands like that. Which for a case breaker like myself, you know, that adds, if it adds like a, a second or two every other pack, that adds up over the course of a break. All right. All right, let's go. Good luck, everybody. Nice. Rated rookie, Paolo Bancaro. Officially your rookie of the year. And that will be for Ed P. Got randomized Orlando. Hopefully first of many, Ed. Uh, we got our first numbered card. That's Aaron Wiggins to 149. That's for OKC. That'll be for Matthew Shira. We'll do uh, we'll do top bottom randomizers for these. Nice, Chet Holmgren Hollow. Looks like there's a I don't know, like a little looks like a machine put a little dot right there, kind of made a little indentation there. So something to keep an eye on, Matthew, but that still goes to you, Matthew Shara. Got randomized the OKC. I guess some hobby shop in Nashville is doing some sort of bounty for this guy. And here's Joe Ingles to 99. I don't know, Google it. And Scotty Barnes is our Elite Series autograph. It's one auto box, right? Yeah, so here's our auto. That goes to Matthew Shira and Toronto. Won that spot in the filler. Gets the Scotty Barnes autograph. 22 out of 99. Dino DNA. Dino DNA. Here's the rookies, Paolo Banquero. Nice. We got Will Barton, orange, 103 out of uh, 199. Jim Way with the Warriors. Well, with the Wizards, that is. Different W team. Lugans Dort. 279. That's for OKC. Miles Turner Orange. That's to 199. And Lonzo Ball. Lonzo Ball. Uh, Ryan, you're a uh, Bulls guy. What's the latest on him? I feel like he's just been beset with just unfortunate injuries and I've heard some people talk about like his career might be in jeopardy at this point. All right, box two. See the Tua of the NBA? Waste of money, Ryan says. Love the guy, but it hurts just seeing him sideline over almost two years. Yeah. 
he's well liked in Southern California. Obviously went to high school out here, went to college at UCLA. Um, my cousin went to see some of his college or his uh, high school games. That's how. That's how big a a thing he was when his when they were all playing there. And aside from his, you know, aside from their dad, he's just kind of a loudmouth dad. You know what I mean? Maybe any other dad who brags about his kid, but just with a bigger microphone. Um, in spite of that, by all accounts, like the the kids are pretty. I think Alonzo's pretty chill, you know? So is LaMelo, I think. But yeah, so it's it's sort of a shame to see to see that happen. Especially when, when Lonzo is on, and I feel like he was growing to be a better shooter too, I want to say. So that evolution was happening. And he was already a great distributor of the basketball. Just in, you know, you always see like, in scouting reports, great court vision, great court vision, great court vision. And usually you're just like, sure, okay. I mean, that's, that's kind of like a filler adjective, right? It's just like a filler praise. You know, they want to say something nice but didn't know what specifically to say. So they say, great court vision, great basketball IQ, stuff like that. But like, in this, the time he spent with the Lakers, like, I saw that. Like, I was just like, oh, yeah, they weren't kidding about court vision. Like, he's making passes... Because at first, you're like, where the hell is he throwing? Oh, that guy. <laughs> There's DeAndre Hunter. I like the little basketball emoji background there. And Patrick Baldwin Jr. That's your, uh, that's your autograph for the box. That's for Scott and the Warriors. So, yeah, great talent, great team guy. Just needs to stay healthy. There's Austin Reeves. There'll be one more game. In LA, let's see if the Lakers can close it out here at home. There's speaking of LeBron James, there he is, 94 out of 99. That'll go to my Lakers, Steve Herrick, Jabari Smith Jr. He's on the box. That's going to go to Houston. That'll be for Jed. Hopefully, if we can find some numbered cards, some autos, maybe some color. Matt Arnold, what's going on? Which Raiders home games? Games will I go to? They have a great schedule this year. That schedule comes out tomorrow? Officially? I forget the teams are playing, though. Duncan Robinson to 79. Yeah, I didn't go to one last year. But I did go to one the year before that. Yeah, I, need to, I need to take a deeper look at that schedule and check it out. There's a Tyrese Martin to 149 for the ATL. That'll be for Matthew. All right, Victor, you're gonna to try to make it to, out to Vegas for a game. Your boy Jimmy G gonna light it up. He's healthy. Probably will. I think the I think I'm more interested to see the evolution of the defense for my Raiders. You know, um, I don't know if anyone saw. Speaking of Las Vegas, I don't know if everybody saw this, but they figured out a land deal for the Oakland A's. I know, I know Oakland A's fans, those of you who are out there, and we do have some in the chat. Are not happy about it yet another Oakland team moving but city of Vegas is happy there um there there wasn't any clarity when they first did the uh when they first did the announcement there wasn't I wasn't exactly sure where that land was it was kind of vague as to where they were going to be building that stadium but I think I saw something today that they're going to tear down the Tropicana for those of you who remember that old casino, they're going to tear that down and they're going to build, and that's where they're going to build the, um, the stadium.
which is there's the Tropicana. That's right across the street from. Oh, that's right across the street from uh, MGM Grand. So MGM Grand, it's on, it's on MGM's on its north, and to its west is Excalibur. And to the southwest would be Luxor. So, I guess the, so. Like the Raider Stadium, if it's if the Raider Stadium's right there, the the A Stadium's right there, and the Golden Knights play like up there. That's on if you're looking at the map this way, and the 15 freeway goes north and south right there. That's what it'll be. Also, here's a Jalen Suggs orange to 199. Matt's saying, Pat Steelers, these are the home game. Pat Steelers, Jets, wow, right, Jets and Aaron Rodgers. Packers, Vikings, Giants, Broncos, Chargers, Chiefs. Those are the home games. That's pretty nice. As a season ticket holder, this is a peak resale season. What do you What do you think is going to be the most, like what, what game do you think is going to be the most expensive on the resale market? Jets probably? Steelers fans travel, right? Steelers or Jets? Steelers, Packers, and... Oh, Packers, right. Those guys travel, too. It'll probably be cold in Green Bay. Let's go to... Well, Vegas will be cold, too, but... A different kind of cold. No snow. <laughs> it's a desert cold. It's cold and dry. A lot of uh, a lot of chapped lips and a lot of static electricity. I get zapped a lot during the during the winter. I don't know if that's just me. Lime green Bradley Beal to one forty nine. We got red Patrick Beverly. 20 out of 99, Orlando edition. There's the rookies, Jaden Ivey, Tyrese Halliburton to 149 for the Pacers. That'll be for Ryan Redman. Uh, but still warmer, yeah, that's true. Ooh, maybe I'll do a bit. U2 is going to be at the Sphere? That place looks awesome. And we got for the Wizards, Johnny Davis, rated rookie autograph for Jim Way and the Wizards. What other shows are there? I gotta look up the schedule. What other shows that are happening inside that sphere? Yeah, you too. That that's that's a band that would that would I feel like have the. I don't know. I mean, they have the vision. I guess if that's the word for it. To produce something that'd be worth. That you know what I mean. They've always been on the forefront. Most of the time, at like doing something different or making some sort of lavish production for their tours. 
I saw them in last, the only time I saw them was in Vegas at the, at the Thomas and Mack arena in Vegas. And um, there was, a, this was a, just after 9-11, I wanna say. So it was a pretty emotional show, but that was the show where they had the, that was the All That You Can't Leave Behind tour, which is a pretty good like comeback record for you two. Yes. Stuff they did after that, I don't know, has fallen short, but that particular album, that sort of a later era YouTube album, I think is pretty awesome. But that's the one where they had the big heart shape stage in the middle, so the main stage right here, and then they had a, like a catwalk type thing that was in the shape of a heart where the edge and you two would, the edge and, I think just the edge and Bono, I think, would, would walk around and, you know, interact with the crowd and stuff like that. But yeah, they still had some incredible video screen stuff up, so they're always, they're always they always do good do good with the visuals. Are they calling this the Octune Baby Tour? Are they they're going back in time? Are they doing the entire album? I didn't mind that album. Now that I'm looking at the at the uh, singles that came out of it, that was that was the album with Mysterious Ways. It's even better than the real thing. Mysterious Ways, One, The Fly. And a couple other good songs on there, too. There's a 184 out of 199, Vince Williams Jr. And yes, Rex, I remember when David Spade, as a character in Wayne's World, played drums on that tour and played drums for even better than the real thing. I remember that. They're shading sharp to 149. And here's red, all stars card, 62 out of 99. So we'll do that same top bottom randomizer. This will be involved with that as well. I guess that record would probably be I guess that record probably would would probably have some cool visuals there. There's Tyrese Maxey, the 79. Josh Giddy Orange. Oh, I think that's the autograph, right? Josh Giddy, orange to 199. Rex loves you too, but you love the South Park episode making fun of him. Man, I should have, should have thought of that would be the next Rex comment. Something related to South Park. There's Shade and Sharp, rated rookie autograph. All right, another box. Ooh, am I going out to CONCACAF in June? I don't think so. I wasn't planning on it, because June, I'm spending a lot of money. Uh, <laughs> the US Open golf is in LA. So that's where my sports entertainment budget for that month is. It'll probably end up being multiple months of my sports entertainment budget, but but yeah, that's where, that, that's where, that's, that's where my money is going.
the Los Angeles Country Club near Beverly Hills. Where are those matches? I think I've got a Sunday Golf US Open day booked. I'm taking that day off, folks, so just FYI. Yeah, and I don't know when the US Open's gonna be in LA. And it's not like, oh, at a Legion. Oh, that's on a Thursday, but I work on a Thursday. Are you taking take another vacation day? Just make it a four-day weekend? Suppose. Suppose I could do that. Well, then I'd have, then I'd have to take Wednesday off for travel. Make it a five-day weekend? Well, I guess I could leave Thursday morning. So Thursday, fly to Vegas, watch the match. Panama, Canada at 4, U.S. Mexico at 6.30, fly back to L.A. Saturday night, go to the U.S. Open final on Although I think Nick and I wanted to watch, we were going to maybe go to first day of the U.S. Open or second day, just bam out of bio. Bam out of bio to 79. All right, Matt Arnold. I'll keep that in mind. Here's RJ Barrett. 90 out of 99. That'll be for the Knicks. Knicks staying alive. And Jabari Smith Jr. Gold? Woo! Nice. Jed, who got randomized the Rockets, gets the guy on the box. Jabari Smith Jr. Rookie Dominator's autograph. Four out of ten. That's nice. Congrats on that. And a nice low number, too. Jay Sean Tate, teammate to 199. That guy's pretty good too for the Rockets. And the Rockets just, didn't they hire, did they hire Ime Udoka? Am I saying that right? Did I just butcher his name? There's Donovan Mitchell to 149. Oh no, is that Chris? Yeah. My longest vacation is usually, usually around Christmas because Christmas and New Year's are usually fall, at least for the next year or two, fall in like a time where it makes it easy for me to take weekends and wrap days off around the weekends and that ends up being like a week and a half or two weeks. Sorry, Rex. All right, another box coming up. Yeah, sometimes I uh, sometimes I check in when like Chris or Michael are alive, and it's like it's like the substitute teacher is uh, it's like the substitute teacher is there. You know, people acting all reckless in the chat. saying things they would never say if Jason and I were on the stream. Hunter is asking, why do I do this to myself? Do, do what? What are we doing? What do we do? Are you questioning why you got yourself into a, a long break, an hour long break?
You Rex, you wouldn't do that? You sure, Rex? You want to? I'm always lurking, Rex. Wow, really? There's people that try to get free stuff all the time. It makes you sick to your stomach. Rex, you would never do that. No, are, are you regretting this already, Hunter? We're only halfway through this break. If you're if you're lamenting the lack of hits, my advice to you: play to the whistle. We are not even halfway through this break. We got got all these boxes to go. All it takes is one hit to turn your your fortunes around in this break. I wouldn't start worrying until we're around like here. <laughs> All right, there's Trey Jones, lime green for the Spurs. That'll be for Jacob. It's a 149. Yeah, Scott, what, what are you doing, man? You're on the East Coast? I'm way too late. There's Jason Preston. To 49. And Bones Highland. 39 out of 99. Bones. Dominator's autograph for the Clippers. That's going to be for Bob. And we'll also do an autograph recap at the end of the break as well. So I guess Anthony Davis avoided a concussion. Probably a good thing. At least according to initial reports. Got a Vince Williams Jr. rated rookie orange for Gilo and the Grizzlies. Uh, no. Clippers got traded, remember? Shaden Sharp rated rookie for Portland, 79. And another Paolo Bancaro. There's Musa Diabate to 99. What are the Anthony Davis playoff injury statistics? I think when he has been in the playoffs, I feel like he hasn't had, knock on wood, haven't, hasn't had a lot of... It's either he gets injured in the regular season and then misses the playoffs, or his team never is in the playoffs. I think if in the playoffs he's actually been pretty healthy. I already watched this game. I do not need to watch Miami, New York Knicks again. I know what happens. Knicks survive. What am I watching? Am I watching some golf? No, no sports center. Not any, I need to, don't need to watch women's college tennis. Quick pitch, no. I need checked in on that. College golf? I guess. Now, Steve was saying, did you know you can't gamble in Alabama? I did not realize that. I thought there was gambling. Is Biloxi in Alabama or is that Mississippi? Mississippi? I thought there was gambling there. That's Mississippi, right? There's no gambling in Alabama? What about... Uh, Isn't there a way around it though? Isn't there like riverboat gambling? Or if you're if you're if you have a boat that's just off just slightly offshore, like it could be a boat docked, you know, on the riverside or, or in a harbor, and then you can gamble on there. Or is that Louisiana?
The rookies, Paolo Bancaro, hollow. Nice. That will be for Ed P and the Magic. Another Jabari Smith Jr. and our Marjan Beauchamp to 149 for Milwaukee. That'll be for Steven Olsen. Walker Kessler rated rookie. He's pretty good. That goes to Bob. I think did he make all rookie first team? And a redemption. Any guesses on the redemption for bragging rights? Jordan Clarkson for the Jazz. That's to 79. Pink Velocity. Got Gary Trent Jr. That's to 199. Stargazing. Trey Young to 99. That's for the ATL. That's for Matthew. Right, next box. No, this is a trophy ceremony. I don't need to see that. Are we going to get Golf Central maybe? All right, maybe we'll, we'll go to Quick Pitch. Who's doing quick pitch tonight? Sierra Santos, maybe? Donde esta Heidi Watney? I think Kelly Nash still. Kitty? Kelly Nash? Katie Noll? All right, redemption is Blake Wesley. Old Blake Wesley. Going to the San Antonio Spurs. That'll be for Jacob. Accident or injury, call Jacob and Ronnie, call Jacob. That's the jingle for the local uh, insurance guy. <laughs> Accident attorney guy. Salino and Barnes used to have a used to have a great jingle until they changed their uh, until they changed their phone number. Because I think it used to be Salino and Barnes injury attorney eight hundred eight 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 eight. I was like that was great, but now it's eight 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 million. Doesn't sound as good. I like all the eights. It might not even that be be that number anymore. You come up with a jazz speed, yeah. Maybe we should come up with a jazz speed jingle. Jazz breaks, f yeah. Breaking the cases every day, yeah. Jazz breaks, f yeah. What about that? That's a good one. Panini, F yeah. Tops, F yeah. Bowman, F yeah. Blaster boxes, F yeah. Salo packs, F yeah. Hanger boxes, F yeah. Random hit breaks, F yeah. Jaspies breaks, F yeah. Save me the day from all the boring breaks, yeah. Jaspies breaks, F yeah. You can have the train whistle, Jaspies breaks. F yeah, saving the day from all the other boring breaks. Yeah, Jasper breaks. F yeah, we won't take our shirts off. Jasper breaks. F yeah, keeping it chill, not like all the other guys. Jasper breaks. <laughs> keeping it cool. We will keep our shirts on. 
Jaspie's brakes. <laughs> we got the best customer service. Customer service, F yeah, fast shipping, F yeah, free shipping, F yeah. Jaspie's brakes, so pro. We're the best just cause we say so. Jaspie's brakes. There's the hundred eight into 49. That's for the Suns. For Steve Herrick, there's another Paolo Bencaro. What's I don't know what you're talking about, Steve. <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm just saying, I wasn't making any reference to anything. I don't know what you're talking about. It's Reggie Jackson to 199. And there's David Roddy. Rated rookie Roddy going to going to Gabe and the Grizzlies. With the spot that he won in the filler. Nice. Darius Garland, lime green to 149. It's pronounced Dumas. That's uh, Shawshank Redemption. Alexander Dumbass, it's Dumas. A 23 out of 50 card. Hmm. We've not. Are, are you serious? Hmm. All right. So Hans. Sohans! Sohans! Alright, they're here. Okay, maybe I did the wrong spell. Here's a, here's, I think this is our first Jaden Ivy. It goes to Rick T in the Pistons. Maybe I did the wrong spell. There's a Keegan Murray. I don't think we've seen him yet. Oh, there he is. Rated rookie, base, Jeremy Sohan. And that'll go to Jacob and the Spurs. I did the right spell. It's Tyrese Halliburton to 149.
Mathurian had a nice season too. Jalen Williams. Nice. Rated rookie signature hollow. Uh, this this is Arkansas Jalen Williams, not Santa Clara Jalen Williams, who's the who's the higher draft pick. But I think this Jalen Williams had a decent season for OKC as well. Matthew Shira. Now this is a story all about how my card life got flipped, turned upside down. And I'd like to take a minute, just sit right there, tell you how I became the breaker of a town called Hermosa Beach. It's a little clunky, Rex, but I see where you're going with it. To 149. I yelled to the cab, you home, smell you later. <laughs> smell you later. Jaden Ivey, hollow. Hello. Goes to Rick and the Pistons. Correct. That's J Will. And then J Len J A L E N Williams is Santa Clara. Jalen Williams, who's the higher draft pick. There's Kevin Huter. The, the last part needs some better rhyming. Yeah, that's the that's the only fix, Rex. In that. Mm, but all Will Smith's music slaps. on the nose. You could have simply said Will Smith's music have a lot of hits. That would have worked just fine. Now you're trying to shoehorn slap in there. We, we know he slapped. All right, that's better. <laughs> two on the nose, maybe two on the cheek. Now you could have you could, you could have said something like that for catcher Will Smith of the Dodgers, Scott. You could have been like, "Yeah, that homer from Will Smith was like a slap across the face of the Brewers." That would have worked. Can we please see a numbered Giannis onto the compo? Should I do my onto the compo spell, Steve? It worked. Yeah, he's a real slap hitter. There you go. Wingardium Antetokounmpo. All right. I kind of saw Bucks, and I thought I was going to get it. There's Brandon. That's 99. I'm losing it. Pelicans, that's going to be for Joshua G. Aha! That's, I mean, it's not numbered. It's a hollow yawn to Santa Huh? Are you not entertained? It's 
parallel. Lamella Ball lights out to 99. Jane Hardy rated rookie hollow. Lamella goes to Charlotte, Steve H. Gordon Hayward to 199. And Derek Harper, 38 out of 99 for the Dallas Mavericks. I don't know, some may argue that the that the hollow parallel is better than something that's numbered out of 299. Kevin with Dallas. The rookies, Jaden Ivey for Detroit, Rick T. We've got a Keegan Murray rated rookie blue to 49. That'll be for Richard and the Kings, King Richard. Dominators, another Giannis, but not numbered. And a Davis Bertans to 149. That'll be for Dallas. That's going to go to Kevin. All right, so that spell only half work. You got a hollow Giannis. All right, two boxes to go. Almost there, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for breaking with us. Uh, this will be the last break of the night, I think. I've got, a, I've got a few orders coming in here. If there's something short that fills, then maybe I'll do it. I got a heart like a truck. At first, I thought that song was pretty good. And I guess it still is. But uh, they're running that commercial a lot. I'm kind of running that song into the ground. React to me. What do you think, ladies and gentlemen? I don't know if there's any country music fans out. All right, second to last box. Good luck, everybody. We're almost there. Stay on target. Gordon Hayward Orange. This one is to 199. Another Paolo Banquero for Orlando. That's going to be for Ed P. Steph Curry. Warriors with a bounce back game against my Lakers. And we've got Caleb Caleb Houston Gold, rated rookie gold for Orlando. I thought it was gonna be someone else for a second Ed P. Which would have been awesome. But his teammate, ten. Country music, like a well-done steak. You'll attempt it if that's all there is, but you're going to be upset. Yeah, no one wants a well-done steak. Here 
There's a Jake LaRuvia, rated rookie hollow for Gabe. Jamal Murray for Denver, that's for Scott. Julius Randle. And Ryan Rollins for Scott and the Warriors. Warriors come out to play. Yeah, Steve Herrick taking obsession to that. She gonna bring uh she she gonna bring bell bottoms back, Steve Herrick? She's got a great voice. Isaiah Stewart to ninety nine. Final box coming up. No, the uh, the other the other oh I thought that was the girl that sang that that truck song. I don't know names. I just know I just hear songs. Don't have enough hard drive space for country music. I'll listen to it though. What's wrong, Hunter? No, not enough Celtics, I guess. All right, we'll try to find you something. Last box, last last chance here. Listen, but first you don't succeed. Try, try again. You got to get your at bats in. You know, not every not every Hall of Famer's first at bat in their career wasn't always a hit. Oh, isn't is Morgan Wong? Yeah. I have no idea who Morgan Wallen is. Benedict Mathurian. There's Dennis Schroeder to 149. There's no case hit, but there is the the photon short prints, which generally go for a lot. This is a fair price point for the box. We've seen some years it'd be a lot more. There's out of 49 Fred Van Vliet. You'd be surprised at how how well some of these hollow rookies, how well they, they will end up Selling on the secondary market. Spencer Dinwiddie to 79. Dino Raja to 99. I feel like Teddy's moved a lot of personal boxes of this, so there's definitely a lot of people who definitely think that price point is, is more than worth it. There's Dino Raja, Celtics, Hunter Edwards. Geez, no more. 81 out of 99 on the board. Scotty Pippen Jr. Orange to 199. Jalen Williams, it's Arkansas Jalen Williams. Ryan Rollins, rated rookie, to 149. Jaden Ivey, rated rookie. Keegan Murray, rated rookie. Kings, Richard. 
And this parallel coming up, I believe, is exclusive to the hobby, the black velocity. Three out of 39. It's Luke Kennard for the Grizz. That's going to be for your G Lo. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's do a quick uh, top bottom randomizer here. Let's roll it, randomize it. Two and a one, three times side on top. We'll get those cards, including that numbered card one, two, and three. Top cards, so top teams will get them. So those teams on top right here, there's that numbered Giannis that you were looking for, Steven Olsen. Boom, gotcha. Here's your autograph recap, boys and girls. Oh, autographs and key rookies and some other hits and other numbered stuff. Jalen Williams for OKC, some Paolos, Hollow Paolo. Got the Jabari Smith Jr. That was gold right there, 4 out of 10. Nice Chet Holmgren as well. So some really nice stuff. There you go, gang. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. There's another full case random team in the store. There's some other big rookies like Jabari Smith Jr. that we can pull out of those. So keep it going. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. I'm Joe. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. And I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.